Let's go over how to upload your videos to YouTube. Before uploading, you can choose to trim your video so that only a portion of it is published. Move these sliders to where you want your video to start and end. If you want to publish the entire video, make sure these sliders are at the start and end of your video. If your recording is not set to 720p or 1080p, it will be resized to 720p when you upload it to YouTube. This may add black bars to the top or sides of your video if you didn't use one of the HD sizes when recording. We recommend that you record at 720p for best results when uploading. If you did not record at one of the HD sizes, you can still resize and reposition your video in the video editor to fill the 720p size. When you're ready to upload your finished recording, click this icon to display all of your upload options. Next, click Upload to YouTube. If this is your first upload, you will be prompted to log into your YouTube account. Click here to open a browser page and grant our app access to your YouTube account. When you're finished, you'll see the publishing options for your upload to YouTube. Click Account to add another account or switch between accounts. Click Title to change the title of your video. Click Description to add a short description of the video. If you'd like to add tags for the video in YouTube, click Tags and enter your tags, separated by commas. Click Privacy to choose whether you want the video to be public, private, or unlisted on YouTube. Here, you can choose the applicable video category. Click Cursor to determine whether the cursor will be displayed in your recording and whether it will be highlighted. You will see a Captions option here. However, please note that YouTube has its own method for adding captions, so it works best to use their captioning system once your video is uploaded. Finally, you can increase or decrease the video quality, which can help speed up the upload process. When you're ready to go, click Publish. After your video is uploaded, you can copy a link to it, open the upload, or use these quick share buttons to easily share it to sites like Facebook and Twitter. You can always find these links again by clicking the Publish History button. This shows the history of all the publishing you've done from your current computer. For more tutorials, just visit our website.